Hello everyone. Today I would like to show you how to use the tool Wikivoyage Districtifier. Wikivoyage Districtifier basically helps you to create um, district overview maps for Wikivoyage. So in the past it was necessary to gather each and every Wikidata ID in order to create such a such a map and this could be a lot of work because you manually had to go to Wikidata or to OpenStreetMap to find out which um, um, which polygon has which uh, Wikidata ID. Like here in the example, Prague, um, the green district, um, has dozens of uh, Wikidata IDs, as you can see here, and you had to manually fetch all of them, which is a lot of work. And that is where Wikivoyage Districtifier can help you. So I quickly show you how to use it. The first step is to go to the place that you would like to districtify. Um, let's try out Sydney, for example. So the first step is to go close, uh, have the boundary box of the city, like now. Click on Load Boundaries. Now all the boundaries, the, the boundary polygons are downloaded from OpenStreetMap. And many of them are overlaying. That's why you have the little checkboxes here on the, on the right, where you can disable them. So it's basically a trial and error. So we don't want those. We, yes, we just want um, admin level 10. So once you have the districts you, uh, you're interested in, you start to name a few districts. For example, let's call one center. And then we add uh, um, polygons to this district. Let's get another one called east. You select the uh, elements which should go into this district. And to deselect, you click on it again, and it's gone. Mm, let's have a third one. But you get the idea. Just selecting, giving it a name, and, and that's it. And you might have seen at the bottom, there's this output um, text box. And once you're done with the districtification, you just click on the out uh, on the text box, copy it, and go to your Wiki Voyage article that you would like to add the map to. Uh, here I opened the sandbox already, where we can try it out. Then you paste the code, click on Preview, and as you can see the the map looks exactly like what you have selected on the map. <coughs> That's all. I think it's rather simple to use and I hope you find it useful. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.